Oh, the 350 is definitely what I'm confusing it with. That is the shift that I thought you were talking about the whole time. But I thought it had an eye attached to it. And it's also the M50. That, might, that has to be what I'm confusing it with. God, man, I, I, I love that game. I want to get back into... Do they still do, like, the updates for the videos for every week for the, the new stuff coming out? Like, I, I want to see some of the... Uh, I also want to see some of the... They used to do, like, cutscene cinematics for when every time they introduce new ships. I would love to see some of them. I haven't seen any of them in a long time. So where's our friends? So where is Loretta? Loretta. We haven't found her yet? Wasn't there a guy over here? Who's that fella? Yeah, the newsletters. Yeah, I haven't I haven't been up on them. I know. I, I it's that's the thing with it. It's like I almost feel like I want to play for that very reason because I spent so much money on it. Like I owe it to myself to play the freaking game. But like I feel like I, I have been gaming so much lately. It's like I don't even know where the heck to fit that one in. So what did, what did Aerith say about Monster Hunter a little while ago? Oh. The move is a counter move. <clears throat> it's just like, looks like a dodge plus a counter attack, but if you actually dodge with it, you get no damage and a free power level. The longsword gets stronger with levels. Oh, that's sick. Um. So what what do you have in problems with as far as putting it into your rotation, Aerith? Like, is it just because it's too slow? Where is this guy? There he is! Oh, I found him. Oh, hello, you're back. What? Back? Only one piece. Well, now it's time I do my part. What? I didn't give the ring to the person Whatever yet. Whatever trinket you need, speak up. Wow, he's fulfilling his, his end of the bargain before I did mine. <laughs> what else do you have to say? Do me a favor and don't forget our promise. Give this ring to old Loretta at the base, base of, the, of high the high wall. A nuisance, I know. But it will help me tie up some loose ends. The base of the high wall? What did you fight? You fought a thing called the Dragon Slayer work? Oh, what's this? What is this? Oh, he sells embers? That's kind of crazy. Blood Red Moss Clump. Use as a maggot repellent. <laughs> Reduce bleeding buildup. Ooh, that sounds nice. Bleeding buildups when attacked by sharp blades and spikes. Once triggered, causes severe damage. This moss clump... Oh, use this moss clump before it reaches that point. That's actually really nice. Fire bombs. Rope fire bomb. Bisque urn attached to a string and filled with black powder thrown behind and explodes, inflicting fire damage. No difference to a fire bomb, save for the direction in which it is thrown. That's sick. So it probably arcs. You probably like swing it underhand and then arc it instead of overhand. Enables a different fighting style and flexibility in adjusting one's circumstances. I like that so much better. Oh, I figured that's who you're talking to. A spear, a mace, a bastard. Oh, bastard sword. Wily uses a great sword normally wielded with two hands. Broad horizontal sweeping attacks make the sword effective against multiple enemies, but unwieldy in narrow spaces. Stomp, use one's weight to lunge forward with a low stance and increase poise and follow with a strong attack for an upward slash. A rising phoenix, Varanon! A reversed rising phoenix. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
All you have to do is a, an attack down. A longsword. Stance. Bandit's knife. Quick step. Instantly step behind or around the side of foes? Why am I not playing with daggers? Are these dex weapons? Yo. Why am I not playing with daggers? Can you have one in both hands? Oh! That sounds freaking awesome. Is that what it does? <laughs> so dagger is low attack speed but high damage? What? What? Wouldn't uh, that's the, that's the most bizarre statement I've ever read. And that dagger has bleed on it. Wouldn't it usually be high attack speed and low damage? Oh man, I want one in both hands. Standard helm? Yes! A new helm made of iron. Used by warriors of old. But one can still expect a sound defense. It is never unwise to wear a sturdy form of head protection against arrows and other somatic threats. What is this though? Massport worn those with something to hide? Used to conceal the face, muffle the voice, and go by the corner of darkness. Darkness. Leather gauntlets, that would be nice. I, I haven't gotten a new upgrade to my, any of this stuff yet. Hard leather boots, boots made of thick leather used by warriors of old. One can still expect the sound defense. Hard leather armor, dude, look how good that looks. Used by warriors of old, it's the sound defense. New shields too. Elkhorn round shield, a buckler, a round shield, a kite shield. All parry abilities. And we also have fire arrows. Oh boy. That would be good against dogs. Man, I wanna I wanna put on a dagger. Hold up. What how do I have Loretta's bow, and I, why do I, why for the life of me, do I not remember dealing with Loretta? I must have met her before if I have her bone. Did I bone Loretta, or did Loretta bone me? What is this? Farron dart? Oh, I could sell, I could sell these old spells. She was a corpse? Oh. Oh, okay. That's why I was confused about it. Have you been to the Undead Settlement? I have. As far as I remember. What is this? I could probably sell this. Let's sell some worker garbs. I have lots of them. I'm selling anything that I have doubles of. Worker trousers. A ring set with large, rare, tearstone jewel. That's a cool name. Temporarily boosts damage absorption when hit points are low. Oh, it's raining like crazy now. Now I hear the thunder. The stone is said to be to tear of sorrow of goddess of... Oh, Katha. And of course, tears are always beautiful near death. I don't think that I've... I don't think I've heard of this, this god yet. Katha. What is she a goddess of? Temporarily boost damage absorption when hit points are low. Man, it's storming. All right, hold up. I got to go close these windows. It's coming right in through the windows right in front of like, right next to me. Hold up. Be right back. One second. Actually, I'm going to take a quick, quick bio break too. So is there any reason that I wouldn't want to wear this ring? I mean, I imagine I would just want to put it on. I could still give it to her when I see her. I want to go find Loretta. 
I also want to check out some of this equipment. So before I buy new equipment. Goodbye. And stay safe. Oh man, I would love that that leather armor. Oh, this place is a bore. Hmm. What good is thievery if you've nowhere to go? <laughs> oh, do you guys hear the thunder? <laughs> Let's, let's see what this is about. I don't think I've ever equipped this. Do, do I mess around with daggers before? Oh, that, that's right. They're, they're really like close range. Oh, so that's what this one does. That's cool. I don't know that I'd use it that often. What would that do for me? To be able to get under an attack? Instead of having a dodge roll under it, I can... Let's see, actually, maybe maybe it has it in the description. Oops. Okay, quick step. Instantly step behind or around the sides of foes. Yeah, that's exactly. Oh, so you could quick step in different directions. No, oh no, that's not what I wanted to do. Why did I press X? Why? What, what am I doing? What is happening? Why am I pressing X? Why? What what game did I play recently that X would be... A, there would be a reason that I would press that button? I wonder. Oh, so you can. That's not exactly easy. But you can. That's not that bad. It really just takes some getting used to. I think mathematically, it really is, you're better off. Why are all these, oh. You're better off with daggers, but it's just, it, you, you're suffering from the close range. So it's kind of just, you know, good balance in this game. All right, let's go. Be, be careful. I better, ah, how if I have any more, uh, souls. I should probably buy some bolts for this thing. Did he have better than wood bolts? Ashen one. They're gonna be the same price, so it's, I guess it's worth looking. Where was he? Down here, right? So we want to talk to him every time we come back in. Oh, hello, and in one piece. Standard bolts, much better. But they're way more expensive. Jeez, I can only get a few. Good. Fire, fire bolts would be nice. Well, that was faster, a faster way to get to him. I like that. Ah, well, how may I? Okay, so now we're gonna get some wooden bolts as well. Ashen nice. B. We want to put on our axe. And I don't think we have enough. Yeah, we don't have enough weight to put on a dagger as well. As much as I would love that. Oh, I could cold clock somebody if I put the Cestus on my offhand. Dude, you still running around with 100k souls on you, dude? Alright, so let's go find... Oh, wait, wait. We wanted to give that guy the bone. We didn't even do that yet. Well, that was the wrong way. Oh, our friend. I'm so sorry you're dead. Where is he? Who's up there? Oh, hello, you're back. And let's give him Loretta's bone. Whatever that means. Heavens, she was already dead. Thank you. I'm not surprised though. Almost a relief, really. Oh, that's sad. You can keep the ring. 
as what? A little trinket of thanks, I suppose. <laughs> <laughs> That's a great quote. We need to give this guy the phone. <laughs> that is a great one. Who's um who's Yuria? Alright, I gave Gay Rat the bone. Alright. Goodbye. Alright. Oh, we have the Estus thing too. Oh crud. We don't have enough souls for it now, do we? We just screw that up too. Didn't we just get an Estus shard? Good to see ye in good health. What? Reinforce Estus Flask. Yes! A lot of Estus. Six and one now. Yes! Pretty be careful. I love it. All right, so now do I Unless you're going to summon phantoms, but it gives him more health. That's why he's able to beat all the bosses. I feel like Wirt's doing the smart thing. Um <clears throat> So now we don't have to tr try to find her anymore, right? There's no, there is, we already know that Loretta's dead. So what else is there to do? Where else is there to go? Foot of the high wall. Cliff underside? At this point, it's just explorating. Explorating. Exploring? <laughs> Man, can't talk now. <clears throat> Where is this place? Where is, where are we over here? <clears throat> oh, I remember there were some spots that I wanted to use my, my spook spell to jump down. What is over here? Oh, is this where I fought the girl? I like, sort of don't remember this spot very well. Try this. Punk. Hmm. Not that I needed to do that at all. I just just feel how it feels. Oh, don't lock yourself off. Oof! I pillaged him right before he fell. See, I don't remember doing this at all. Who are you? Aha! Unkindled, are we? Yes. Welcome to my abode. Hello. I am Cornix, an old pyromancer. Yes! Someone say fire? A cage, as you see now. 
What's up, Brody? here we are. An encounter for the ages. <laughs> How did he get locked I up? I hear the unkindled make for fine vessels. Care to learn some pyromancies from this old man? Yes. Huh. Most wise. A chance encounter should not be squandered. Yeah, why would I say no? To reiterate, I am Cornix of the Great Swamp. The pleasure is mine. <laughs> Thanks, dude. What did you give me? Ooh, a hand axe. Is he gone? He's just dead now? Damn. down here how did I not do this before I, I actually don't even remember getting to this shrine the bonfire so it looks like I want to hop down here is that someone behind me Oh, see, like, that's, like, the kind of area that I would think that, like, underneath that bridge, that area down on the bottom, like, that's kind of in a spot that I would want to go with that spell. I'm not entirely sure. This seems like a trap. Oh, I see that guy over there. I got that already? Damn, he just hit me with the bucket. I thought he was going to throw it. What's this guy's deal? Ooh, souls. Did I go down here? Because I don't remember. Go oh, no. I just locked myself out, didn't I? Oh, no, I didn't. I thought I was going to crit him. Oh! A fire clutch ring. I'm finding all kind of stuff. Oh, so this is the way to the giants. Oh. Alright. Now at least I have an idea of where the heck I am. What is this ring that I just found? Also, we found a hand axe. A crude hand axe that serves both as a weapon and a tool for many uses. Favored by the pyromancers of the Great Swamp, this axe has a short range, but only moderate weight and reasonable damage. Easily wielded and more powerful than it appears. War cry! Yes, I love the war cry. And oh, the uh, the ring that I just found does what exactly? Oh, look how awesome that ring looks! Ring depicted in the hand of grasping a red stone, increasing fire attack, but also compromises damage absorption. An old fable in Londor claims that the lure of the clutch ring reaches out to the crestfallen, who might otherwise be overcome by despair. What perfect place to get a fire ring, considering that I just got fire magic or of some sort. See, like, I sort of want to jump down there. Did I go this way? Oh, I guess I did, because I went through that door. Oh, did you see me, like, slice through the rock? Oh, God. I didn't even see that guy here. I must have, because that guy probably had an item. Hmm. Where 
Where am I going? See, but if I jump down there, those guys are going to bomb me. What else is down there? Do I see any any reason why I would want to jump down there? Why can't I take this off? Yeah, oops. I didn't see that until after I jumped, Katase. Sorry. Oh, that's how I got to the bonfire? Oh, through that door. Sewers. See if there's any items or something down there. Like, what would what would I want to go down there for? Oh, I remember those guys. You see anything? I don't see anything down there. Okay. All right. I'm starting to get an idea of where I'm at. This is when I came up through the sewers. I ran this way to get to the spot where the great wood tree is. Got it. So now I have a better understanding of, of where I am. I guess now the real question is, why? <laughs> Sorry guys, don't take it personally. I was just trying to help you. I did it for you. Yo, what's up, Traxium? How are you, Tom? What's going on, guys? Hello, hello. What's up, Raiders? How was your stream, buddy? Chris, what's going on, man? Welcome in. <laughs> Shout out. There you go. I did it. Donkey Kong Country. The old game. How was it? I don't know. What is all this then, Chris? I have I have no idea. Yeah, we gotta help. We have to help <laughs> Axiom get to affiliate status. <clears throat> yeah, throw him a follow. Oh god. Oh, that's not what I wanted. Load that son of a bee. Hooey. I guess he had a good stream, maybe? <laughs> Are you gonna attack? Jeez, he was trolling me. Jump down across the bridge? This one? Or that bridge? Towards those guys? I feel like we went that way. Maybe we didn't go far enough? I'm having a hard time remembering all the stuff that we did over here. This one. Oh god, there's a dog. Does he not see me? That was easy. Why didn't he? I guess because I had. The, I guess because I had the spell on? Totally forgot you can live stream stream announcements. What do you mean? Uh. Steam announcements? I'm so excited to to hear about the PlayStation. It's now, right? You guys gotta fill me in on what happens. I know exactly. 
Or at least we got one person to drag out. I always forget that I just need one hit on those. Oh, a worker hat! Oh, that's all I wanted. This is all I- this is the only reason I played this game all day. It was just for this worker hat. It's all I wanted to play this game for. Thank you for making my life. <laughs> this is all I wanted. This is why I'm playing this game. Come on, throw your thing at me, man. Oh, wow, he totally missed on that. Where did he go? Did he just launch himself off? <gasps> what a fool. Ow! Why do I always forget about that extra attack? Oh, that and that one too. You get me every time, bro. It's like you really only have time to get like one attack in on them. A big attack? Was that worth it? Not a good opening fight. I love my hat. Ugh, I love it. So we wanted to go this way. I don't even really know why. Sony and Nintendo have only exclusive I like, care about generally. That's that's but so that was normally the case, Chris. But now, as far as we know, Xbox has picked up a bunch of developers. So they might have a lot more stuff than we're used to. Just get it one more time. There we go. Well, I don't know why I attacked why. Oh, there's another one? Another puppy? Here, puppy. I didn't mean it. What? Do we not go this way? Oh, this poor fella. Huh. That was an interesting little area to explore. But. I don't know what those developers are. I've heard rumors of the guys who made Pillars of Eternity coming onto Xbox's consoles, but like, is it enough? You know what I mean? Is it enough? I don't know. Well, that didn't work the way I thought it was gonna. That did not work the way I thought it was gonna. I thought I was gonna be able to get the t attack on him. I tried to do the run attack. There it goes. Of what, wait, the second half of what I just said? Hey, oh wait, actually, hold on. We gotta put our uh, game back, right? Is it updated now? I didn't even look before. Did we, did any of that stuff change? Okay. So we actually never did change our title before. Now I know if I switch off, to either switch the title before, or drag a new screen. How are you, Ollie? Yeah, that's, I mean, I can't personally imagine going with a PlayStation 5, uh, play, uh, with an Xbox over a PlayStation 5. However, I don't know everything that's going to be on the Xbox, so... What is going on over here? Why is this glow? Oh, it's a lantern. Is that somewhere I want to jump down into? I feel like I've been saying that for a while, but maybe I've been down there already. See, this is why I want... I might, you know, I've been down there already. Because I think that is the body that I knocked off of the uh, post to get the shield that I have. Oops. I think I got this shield from that that body. <laughs> I stepped away after Horizon 2. Did we get Specs or Elden Ring? Neither of the above, but we did get a link for Specs. Um, they just didn't release it. Oh wait, was that it? Here. I'll copy this and repost this that Tom sent us. Wee! There you go. So that that's the specs there. Some of them at least, Gail. Not all the stuff, but at least some stuff that wasn't released today 
but it was released two days ago. Didn't we come in here? Yeah, we've already been here. Oh, this is where that, that, what's his name guy was. So there is more to explore. Hmm. Oh God! I should have. Oh, I survived. What is this? Why did I just jump off? I heard the guy's voice, and I got. I got curious. There he is. I should have jumped off as soon as I heard him. Hmm. I should have jumped. I want to rest with you. What is that thing? Oh, that's right. We haven't fought that guy yet. Oh, so there is stuff. Oh, man. I would love a bonfire over here somewhere. That would be really nice. Oh, yeah. I always forget that. Caden, thank you, man. It looks like specs for a modern PC. Hmm. Mmm. Ah. Oh. Don't disappear like that. You had me downright worried. I didn't know where you were. But thanks to you, an epiphany has struck me square in the head. Oh, you're welcome. I've unraveled the riddle of this inscrutable lift. Ooh, that's exciting. Because <laughs> I couldn't figure it out. Are you not going to tell us? <laughs> On some days, I begin to doubt myself. I went up the tower... So I thought, then somehow ended up here. I'm not exactly sure what happened. Anyhow, okay. do you see that? That humongous beast? I do, very much so. I'm no coward and I have a steady hand, but that thing makes my skin crawl. <laughs> Same. How now? Think twice before you go down that road. So that that's the tip he gives us? I could try talking some sense into him. No, I think not. He's far too overheated. Ah, uh, you made a funny I've joke on him, man. I've got to use my head and think. Hmm. Hmm. So he's suggesting not to fight the demon. I could try talking some... Okay. Hmm. How does that help us? Also, can I go around this way? Probably not. This way? Ooh. 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 Nope. Oh, God. Well, now we're screwed. Onion man assist. Is that what we want to do is fight that guy? We already know where you are not to be trusted. Oh, that's death. God, this is so frightening. It doesn't seem like a good idea at all. Maybe I should put my helmet back on. Well, oh God, it sees me. Now. It sees me. I, Zigward of the Knights of Katarina, ah. fight by your side. Ah. Ah. He's gonna fight with us? I'm gonna go get this item. Ooh, Homer Bone. Nope. Mm. Mm. Am I not hitting him? There it goes. Are we hitting him? Oh gosh. Uh. Oh yeah. Shoot him with a crossbow. Eat it. Hell yeah. Ooh, a fire gem. Good job, dude. 
That was quite a performance. But you mustn't get in over your head. We unkindled must put our duties first. But <laughs> Kill for the it. moment, we have a toast to make. Cheers, man. Ooh. To your valor, my sword, and our victory together. Huzzah! Long may the sun shine. <laughs> oh, he's drinking with us with his invisible mug. A toast. Let's do it. Point up, point forward, point up. Wait, that's not the toast I wanted. I always do that. I want to toast him. Toast, where are you? Toast, all over. Toast. Does that make a difference? Yes! <laughs> we did it. Well, I'm going to have myself a little nap. I want to do the same thing. The I get thing that. The thing to do, really, after a nice toast. <laughs> Guys, I'm kind of I'm kind of excited about a lot of those games. <laughs> oh, I love him. He's my spirit animal. The Michelin Man. Oh, I can't even talk to him anymore. The dude's literally just passed out. What I would love is a bonfire. That's what I would love. Come on. Ah. Wait, tall grass again? What does that mean? Dude, so Dorenzo, by the way, man, great job yesterday. So yesterday I played, while Chris was streaming, I was playing D&D, &D, um, and it was Dorenzo's first time dungeon mastering, and he did a really good job. We were playing through the campaign setting, um, the, the pre-made adventure, uh, Storm King's Thunder, um, and it was an awesome introduction. It was a ton of fun. So kudos to you, man. Good job. But I haven't even really talked to you too much about it because I left immediately to get into to um, the movie night. And we played on Tabletop Simulator. And it was like, <clears throat> I've been playing D&D &D on Tabletop Simulator, but it's, it's fun to see the different styles of the ways you could play on that. Just on that one game alone. Like how many different versions of... Dungeons and Dragons you could play with it. That's so why I gotta obviously get up there somehow. Yeah. Okay, that was not the jump I was looking for. Let me barrel through this. Yeah. Woohoo! I did it. Thought I was gonna use my crossbow, but I didn't have to. Oh come on! Oh my god! <sighs> He literally, I, oh my god, I got a friggin' set of armor! Yes! So good. I'm so hyped. Yeah! How do I get this guy down? Oh, don't, how about you don't miss him? I guess I'm gonna have to put my crossbow on? Or I can, maybe I can hit him with a spell from up here. Hold on. Can't wait to see what this armor does. There you go! Oh, we just threw him into the fire. It's better than having to re-equip the crossbow into the other hand. A pale tongue? What the? Come on, bonfire! That's all I want. But that's- I mean, I got more. With that armor. Because I was looking- I was looking to re-equip myself. Oh, more items. A large club? Hell yes! Come on. So... I guess it's confirmed that there's no bonfire over here, which I'm- I'm- I'm honestly- I'm shocked! 
I thought for sure we'd have one. Maybe through like this door or something. Unless I missed it. Which is quite possible. Oh, look how creepy this is. God dang, this game is creepy as F. So what were, you, what were some of your takeaways from it? I'm sure we'll talk more about it, but what were some of your takeaways from the game, Renzo? Imagine the bonfire was hidden in there. How cool would have that? That would have been really cool. Show secret. Come on, it's gotta be around here somewhere. No. I guess through here. I'm gonna see how much longer I have, because I have something that I have to do. Usually I started at 6, 5.30. So let me go quickly find out. I just gotta make a quick phone call, guys. See what's going on, see how much time I have. And I might be able to continue to play a little bit longer or I might have to run. Okay, so usually I would have to run at 5.30, but I am good, I have more time. So he's gonna fight his way on his own. To the tower, what tower? All right, let's see what this armor is like then. I'm, now I'm like, I wanna read it. <clears throat> I was actually worried that we were gonna lose that fight and I was gonna lose my ember. <clears throat> So let's see what the heck this even does. First of all, we got a large club. Do we already have one? No, we didn't. Large club is exactly what you would think it would be. A large wooden club. <coughs> Required, requires considerable strength to wield, characterized by savage leaping attacks. It weighs, <coughs> its weight makes it easier to break the guard of shields. Oh, what? What? I'm about that. <coughs> Yeah, Dorenzo, also if you're here, not only would I like your opinions, but if you want, I can talk to you about, I took uh, some notes for you, if you want me to talk to you about them here or afterwards. Let's see what this northern helmet is. So what do I have on now? Well, well normally I have this on, its weight is 4.6. That's usually what I'm using. <clears throat> but this is a, a weight for eight, so it's not much heavier. I could probably throw this northern helmet on So let's do that for starters <clears throat> Why would I want yeah, this is much better This is better for bleed poison curse, but physical is up with the northern helmet <clears throat> Oh, you'll be on discord later nice how is everyone, what did everyone else think of the game? I hope you had a good time. How about that? Did you have a good time DMing? Cause you, you were a natural at it, man. And I, my gut suspicion was correct. <clears throat> okay, whoa, 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 that's a lot heavier. But wow, is it so much better. Oh, look how freaking viking we look! Oh, I love it! I love this armor so much more. Do I? Let's see what else we have. The, I, I think it's more important that we change our pants out, because our pants have been... Let's let's put our... Wow, the Lothric armor is so heavy. Northern gloves. That's close. Are they lighter? Oh, they're the same weight. Yes. Trousers of stalwart northern warrior. Thick leather boots lined with fur. In addition to their protection from the blunt strikes, they excel at retaining heat. Provided good resistance in the cold. Oh, we want to read this. So, uh, it's basically the same, same description for all of these. Yeah, I was excited to see everyone messaging each other today. Like, I could tell that all the other players were pretty hyped because they're all into their characters so quickly. <clears throat> 
Yeah, I think that ultimately, as far as, oh, look how I look cool now. Hell yeah, dog. Do I want to change any of these other items? I could probably drop an item and then put on the better armor. Might be a, a good choice for us. But I would have to drop something that's three and a half pounds. Maybe my spear? Just get rid of the spear? The only reason I have it on here is to break. I don't know, I think I look pretty cool. I'm good with this. <clears throat> I know, uh, I know besides Alex and I, they're all strangers to you. Is there anyone <clears throat> at the table you liked more or less? Uh, as far as, as in, in regards to what? Like their characters? Um, or as far as their gameplay style? Like what, what do you mean? I think that initially, <clears throat> um, I was possibly a little concerned about, uh, the guy who's playing the rogue. Um, <clears throat> I guess he was the one who maybe came from wargaming in the past. So as a player, it seemed like, cause he was suggesting, oh, like, you know, just, just, if you can't see light, just throw on light. It's like, well, I wouldn't throw on light unless someone said it. So, unless someone said they couldn't see, I wouldn't, my character wouldn't know that they couldn't see, so I wouldn't just do it, just to do it. And like that outside of character, like, meta play, where it's like, you just assume that everyone is, knows what the other players are gonna do, but that's not exactly how that game works. Like, you have to assume your characters don't know. Like, even if you're talking about it on the outside. Um, but it was, it's fine. He, you know, he, I think that it's just a transition of games, you know, so it, it was, it didn't, nothing weird happen. As far as characters go, I think Scraw is pretty cool. I'd never played with a Kenku before, so I like that. If anyone in chat has ever played alongside a Kenku, Kenku only speak with mimicry. So that's a, a really interesting roleplay dynamic, but playing with it, it was a lot smoother than I thought it would be. I was actually more concerned, like, okay, this person's just gonna, like... I get concerned about people who play characters who don't want to talk because I feel like it's their cop-out that they don't want to roleplay. But it was clear to me within the first few minutes that it was the quite opposite. He was using it as an ability to enhance his roleplay. This guy's gonna try to kill us. Oh god, they're both gonna try to kill us. I can't, like, run up to these guys, because they do, like, this weird AoE thing. That, that thing. That thing. Whatever they just did when I hit them and, like, I ricocheted off of them. I'm better off to just hit him from range. And another Alluring Skull. So that was cool. That was, like, a, a nice thing to know. That I was like, oh, this, this... He's, he's using it in a really good way. It's making the character more interesting. Um... Like, I definitely do what I usually do when I play. Hey, you send that for him to, he plays a lot of 40k. I knew it. I knew it as soon as the way he was talking about how he was going to play his characters and, like, the way he was strategizing in combat. Not that it's a wrong way to do things, but it's just different because he's using, he's, he's seeing the party as a collective unit, not as individual characters, you know? Which totally makes sense, considering where he's coming from. Come on, doggy. Oh. oh. I actually messed that up. Oh god, there's two of them! Swing wildly. Oops. I should oh god, he's alive! Read message. Like a dream. Um. 
So as far as rules go, I'll get more into characters, but I do, I would like to let you know, just so you do know, as far as I know, uh, you, you were playing the monk, I guess, last? So you had stated at one point that you can, um, <clears throat> you can have a bonus attack with your offhand weapon. Uh, but it would be as a punch. But as far as rules go, it's actually only the monk who can attack with a fist weapon or just as like a punch or a kick or whatever as a bonus action. That's actually only a monk ability. And, um... It would make sense, but the rules specifically state with uh, two two weapon attacking that you need to have a light a weapon with light property or f and finesse or something like that in an offhand, <clears throat> but it doesn't count as a just a fist weapon, which is weird. You would think that you could technically you're not supposed to, but I don't see a problem with it. It's only one damage. I think it makes it cool for role play. So I think that was a cool decision that you made to let them do- Oh god, two of these friggin' things? Oh, I don't like this at all. This might be a problem. This might be a problem. Alright, let's get out of here. So we can clear our way. Why am I not locking onto them? Now you're locking onto them. Well, that doesn't do much damage. What am I doing? Damage, damage! Oh, that wasn't enough. That wasn't fast enough. See the spell attack that I said I... Sometimes I don't like how slow the spells... Oh god, oh god, I was supposed to dodge roll. Don't die, don't die, though. Keep, keep going back, keep going back. Come on, hit her with the spell. Hit her with the spell. I'm gonna break off of her. I don't know what my surroundings are like. I'm gonna lock myself into a hole. I'm gonna put my shield on. Go into this. A war cry. Now I'm gonna get back into a situation where I'm more comfortable. So she's on the stairs. Nice. Got her. That war cry saves my ass sometimes. Um. <clears throat> Yeah, but I, it's, I think it's too early to tell too much about the other characters, though. <laughs> Kaden. Where is she? She's up here still. <clears throat> Come on, hit her. Nice. God, she's casting. She's casting. Oh, I got out of the way. I want to go further forward? No, I don't think that's the best idea. Come on. I missed her. Come on, lock on, lock on, lock on. You don't have time for this. Why are you, what are you locked on? Oh God, that's what you're locked on to? There's people up there. I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. Roll, roll. That went terribly wrong. That everything that could have went wrong, went wrong there. I was locking on to these guys. What are you doing up there? Huh. I don't have- oh wait, I do have more. There, now I have some of that. Are you serious? I missed it! I missed the attack! <laughs> I missed the attack. Go out onto the roof? Might as well just do it again. You know what I'm gonna do, actually? I'm going to... I'm gonna do this with my staff to make it so this does more. There's, of course there's no more level. I was gonna say, I could probably hit him, kill him with two hits now. What? What was that about? Should be able to kill him in two hits. Yeah. I, I basically I use my the boost to my spell power. <sighs> oh, 
Oh no, 50k souls, dude. I'm so bad, dude, that, I'm so mad at you. Wait, no, I'm so mad at you game for work. <laughs> there you go. None of that was a real sentence, but I think that you know what I'm trying to say. I want to open that chest, but I feel like it may be a mimic. And I'm a little concerned about that. So Katase says, you found the right spot. Let's so now go onto the roof. This roof? Oh no! That is not what I wanted to happen. Oh my god, that is awful. Why? Why did I just do that? <laughs> Why? Oh. <laughs> I don't even know how that happened. Thank you, Gomfer. I don't even know how to get to where I just was. I was so far away. Ugh. I know, he always has so many souls on him. He just like runs around with like 100k all the time. Alright, this way, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, this way we want to go. Remember this. Come on, don't screw up, don't screw up. That was terrible. We were doing pretty good too. And then, and then, dang. Man, we are really far back. Can I lock onto this guy instead? Wow, I actually attacked faster than him. How am I going to remember where the hell I was? Nope. He attacked faster than me. Ooh, a firebomb. This guy was the pyramid. Oh, wow. We did a lot before that situation. Gosh, I don't remember where the heck we were. Oh, we still have to go all the way that way? Oh man, we were so far. What's up, Croker? What's going on? We were just doing so good and I jumped off a roof on accident. How about you don't keep attacking and you do something different? Jeez, this guy! Oh god. God, he's annoying. <laughs> Still not dead? <laughs> I hate him. Maybe I should go recharge. This guy just... Mess me up with his own chamber pot. <laughs> okay. Oh boy. Did you finish the rest of that manual last night, Gomper? I guess we could just go down this way instead of having to use the spell. Okay, we can do this. There's there's a wolf over here, right? Or a dog or something. I figured there was one. I thought there was two, honestly. Like one of them's gonna come out of nowhere. Okay. He's got my attention. Nice, good job. Good job, character. You just act around him. I feel like there should be some sort of soft lock on system with this game somehow. Get out of there, get out of there. Don't do what you usually do. Gonna pack a bunch. Oh god, the other one's coming at me now. Jeez, this guy doesn't stop. I'm gonna die. Ugh. They don't stop attacking. I don't. I think that I don't. I don't really like those guys. Oh, I'm bleeding. That also doesn't help. I don't really like those guys. They're not my favorites.
hear someone. Okay, now we... Went into the tower. And we rolled off when we heard the hmm. Which we probably won't hear anymore. Did you make another character or anything? Oh, now I'm going down? Oh, crud. Why am I going down? Up. Two floors. What in the hell? Is there something, a lever I could pull or something? Bro, this game... <laughs> now I can't ever get my souls back. Because I can't make the elevator go up. None of these levers are... You can't yank any of these things? Stupid levers. As a mech pilot? Dude. I would- it would be an- an honor <laughs> to have Knackle as a mech pilot. That sounds like exactly something like Knackle would love. <laughs> Is he gonna name his mech Geppetto? Hmm. How do I go up? I gotta go up to get my souls. How will I do that? Is there a button or something? A drone operator? That's a cool thing to have been added to the game. Is there something on the sides? Maybe, wait, wait, wait. Oh, that's a read message. Oh, I'm so upset that I died. We had such good things going for us. I bet you if I just would have walked on top of there, there would have been a stupid bonfire. Hmm. I have no idea what to do. There's not even any clues to anything. I feel like it's got to be something with these levers. There's got to be something you can do to move them. Well, there goes those souls. I'll never find my way back there. Nothing out here? Man, this sucks. I was going- it went up before. So, what can I do differently that will make it go up? It's not even like this is a puzzle because there's literally nothing to interact with whatsoever. Like, none of these uh, things that are in the room, I can touch, use, or do anything with. Try up. That's what I'm trying! Praise the night. Button in the middle of the elevator? It's the one that brings me down? Yeah, souls are money in this game, yep. Unless there's another button. I don't want to just go randomly exploring down here now. I think there was a boss down here. Didn't I fight? Didn't I fight like a boss down here or something? I feel like I did. Oh god, he's, there's still something down here. Oh, well, I still have that to deal with. Okay, that's not something I want to deal with right now. What? What? Didn't I fight that thing? No, we have to stay on target. We want to figure out how to make this go up. And it went up just the last time we were here. It went up. Unless I have to, like, go back to the fire link and reload or something. Like, why would that... Why would our death have interacted with this puzzle? 
There has to be another way. There has to be something. 